Joel Tamala. Today I'm going to share with you the topic I titled Under Pressure. Are you finding it difficult to be still, to focus, and to be calm when under pressure? If so, good luck. Stay tuned. Some people get frustrated when their boss asks them to do some certain amount of work and to finish it in a certain period of time. And because of that, they think and believe that the boss didn't like them. That is why he's putting them always under pressure. It is because he has trust on you. If your boss does not have trust on you, he will not always look for you to work for him. You may not understand, but I can give you a few examples. Like most times in family, a lot of parents will ask some certain kid to work more, to do some certain things in the home than others. And this kid will be thinking that, oh, my parents dislike me. That is why I'm the only one that is working more. You do not know. Deep down or deep down in their heart or maybe unknown to you, they trust you. They believe in you that you can deliver. You can do what they are asking you to do than your other brothers or sisters. That is why they know that you are more capable to do it. That is why most times they believe and they believe in you. So they have that confidence. That is why they are asking you. It does not mean that they hate you. This can also be in the working place. So if your boss is asking you to do some certain amount of work than other employees, it's because most times it's because he trusts you. He believes in you. He knows that you can deliver. So the only thing I'm saying to you is that you have to be brave. You have to deliver good results because if your boss is always asking you to do something, it's a sign of trust. It's not only a sign of hatred or dislike. It is a sign of trust. He has confidence in you. That is why he that is why he have the confidence and he believe that even if he put you under pressure, you can deliver than the other people. So if you fail to deliver, you will lose that that trust and you will lose that place in his heart and he will look for someone else to do that job and when someone else go and do that job then you have lost your place in his heart so if you are in a certain company or a certain organization and the boss or the people that is in charge always want you to do some certain certain amount of work deep down look very well analyze the situation very well you will surprise that it's because they have confidence they believe in you that is why most time they are asking you to do do his work. It does not mean that they hate you. It's that be because they have trust in you that you can deliver. So I just want you to be calm and continue delivering good results, even when you are under pressure, because you don't know what is in his heart. This can also be found in sport. Most times, like as a, a footballer, most coaches will put you under pressure. I didn't know, unknown to me, if I, I can give you an example about my own life, Unknown to me, when I newly came to Rouen, in the city of Rouen, I was playing in the city of Rouen. Unknown to me, the coach was always putting me in pressure. We all go for like precision training, with, for training, fitness training. Most people did their fitness training for one week. There were some other people did it for two weeks. But me, I did my fitness training for one month. And after even the fitness training, the guy is not playing me. Even I was physically fit and strong that even I was very fit that even my teammates in, in training, they're all complaining. Even when we go to play matches, they're all complaining. But unknown to me, I was thinking that this man ate me. So I leave FC Raw and go to Petit Kevi. So when I wanted to leave the club to go to sign for another club, is there I know that this man really believes in me, he trusts in me, he's only he won't, he's working on me mentally. So what I have to say is like, you have to develop your mental. Don't make pressure scare you away. In the future, if you look back, you will see that most of this pressure, what most of these trials and pressure that you, you face, that sometimes you give up, sometimes you are complaining up and down, these things are building you. They are making you to become the real person you are made to be, to prepare you for the future, to become the real person, a better version of yourself. Every pressure, everything, all these things you are facing, your boss is putting you, or your coach are putting you, uh, uh, whatever person is putting you, in many places, nothing happens for, for no, nothing. It is for a good reason. It is written that everything works together for good. That pressure is making you to be a better person, to build you, to make you, to transform you, to mold you, to become the real person you have to be. Everything that happened, it happened for a reason. It is all for your own good. So I'm telling you, stay there, 
be calm, walk through it, go through the pressure, and you will see at the end of the day, you will see that, ah, when you look back, you see that, oh, so all these things have been for my own good, and this is what you will see. And I believe that you are outshining that, that situation. If you are new to my channel, make sure you press the subscribe button and turn on the notification so you will get every new video I will be uploading daily. Thank you once more for your time and I wish you a wonderful day. Bye.